Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to find the file name and location for an image that you're using for your Windows desktop background. So let's say you're using the Windows slideshow for your background and you have hundreds or thousands of pictures and you find one that you like and you'd like to know the name or let's say you don't know where it is or you don't remember where you set your background slideshow to uh, happen from. It's a pretty easy way to do so. So it's a two-step process. One of them is a quick registry entry and the other one's the uh, PowerShell script that you'll have to have the registry entry run uh, once you get it set up. So here's what the registry will edit will do. If you open it with Notepad, you kind of see it's pretty basic. So if you ever want to remove it, you could just you know open it and just go there and uh, remove what it added. So what it's pretty much going to do is uh, call this uh, PowerShell file here, this little script, to run. So first thing we have to do is add this to the registry, just like that. And this file here. We have to put it in the Windows folder. So you just copy it in there, move it or copy it. Permission. Okay, so uh, you might have to restart uh, Windows Explorer, restart the computer if it just, if you don't get the menu right away. So what'll happen now when you right click and show more options, you know, in Windows 11, you have to go to show more options. And of course you could, uh, set this back to Windows 10 style menu if you want to do that. We have a video for that as well. And then you have this find current wallpaper and this will call this PowerShell script here. So it's telling you that's where it is and you could launch File Explorer and take it to, take you right to it just like that or if you just want to do it and uh, just to get the location without opening you just do that as well. It tells you the file name. So that's pretty cool easy to do. So I will uh, zip these up here, put them in the description, then you could just download them uh, as configured right there, and you could just add them to your computer and uh, take it from there. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.